Hi, my name is Trung Lu, and I am a member of the Citation 10 customer support. Today, I'm going to show you the steps to download, install, and how to use the iCast Viewer software from the Cessna customer support website, and show you how to install it to a laptop or desktop computer. First, navigate to your internet browser, and navigate to Cessna.com, Select the CessnaSupport.com. Here, CessnaSupport.com will open and you can register with the website or if you have already registered, put in your username and password and click Log On. It will now open to the CessnaSupport.com. Navigate to My Model. Citation 750, and in the middle column, navigate to Maintenance Information and click on Maintenance Software. Next, under the Maintenance Software, scroll down to Updated iCast Message Viewer 2.0, and here you'll click on Click Here to download. Now you will want to save this file and click Save and we recommend you to save it onto your desktop and click Save. Once this is done, click the Close dialog. Now you can either minimize your browser or close your browser. Now on your desktop, navigate to the Cast Viewer icon and select that. Click the Run button. Here is the iCast Message Viewer, and if you already saved your iCast Message File folder, you can navigate to that by clicking the Open, and then selecting the Desktop and your iCast File folder, and then click Open, and then you'll select the first file, and select Open. And then on the other side, go ahead and click Open and select your second file. And here you have both of them showing the iCast message. You can scroll up and down to view your iCast messages, the time and date of the iCast message. Double clicking on the iCast message will give you the extended description and it will also give you the source, the trigger. Once you're done, you can click OK. And on the other side, you can also scroll up and down, and double-clicking the iCast message will also give you the extended description. It gives you the source and the trigger for the messages. Once you're done, you can click OK. This concludes this brief tutorial on downloading, installing, and running the iCast Viewer software. If you have any questions, please contact Team 10 at 888 six two two four seven eight nine